Hi, Mom and Dad. I have left this stupid town. I am so sick of this place and everyone here. I've gone to LA with my guy. He gets me. I'm going to be a big star. Don't bother looking for me. I'm not coming back to this stupid place. Take care of yourselves, Gabrielle. Hey guys, it's Gabriella and welcome back to the season finale of Envy. Oh my goodness, we have so many things we need to have answered. So we're just gonna jump right in and see what happens. Envy, chapter 12, Runaway. So tired. Okay, is Gabby dead? Is she alive? Like what? Please don't let Gabby be dead. I will be so sad if Gabby's dead. Okay, we just had a big fight, okay? She doesn't need to die. Hang on, she's awake. Gabriella, it's Mrs. Mendez. Gabby's mom? Hi, Mrs. Mendez, it's Gabriella. Is everything all right? Gabriella, do you know where Gabrielle is? <laughs> huh, isn't she at home? No! <laughs> I'd gone to wake her up this morning, but she wasn't in her room. Her bed hadn't been slept in. I know because she never, ever makes her bed. <laughs> her closet was empty, everything was gone. Gabby? Gabby! It was then I noticed the piece of paper on her bed. Hi, Mom and Dad. I have left this stupid town. I am so sick of this place and everyone here. I've gone to LA with my guy. He gets me. I'm going to be a big star. Don't bother looking for me. I'm not coming back to this stupid place. Take care of yourselves, Gabrielle. <gasps> Rude! <laughs> Did you know about this, Gabriella? No, I didn't! I can't believe it! She did say she wanted to go to LA. When did she say that? No! I can't believe she would do this! I don't want Gabby so angsty and rude. Mrs. Mendez, Gabby and I haven't been on the greatest terms lately. What do you mean, Gabriella? I thought you girls were best friends! I found out that Gabby had done some things to me, and I confronted her yesterday in school about it. Done some things? What did she do? She broke into my locker and wrote witch on my photo, and she spread some gossip relating to my parents in school. <laughs> Nobody knew the true Gabby. I am fully aware that Gabrielle has a rebellious streak. She can be difficult, but this, this is going too far even for her. <gasps> Anyway, I only mention this because I think you should know that we argued yesterday in school. Gabriella, this guy that she talks about in her letter, do you have any idea who it might be? I have no idea, Mrs. Mendez. Gabby has been really secretive recently. Oh, <laughs> it's the murderer! <gasps> Thank you, Gabriella. I'm gonna call Jasmine and Mei Ling now. Please call me if you have anything else to let us know. Sure, Mrs. Mendez. It was shocking, but it also didn't come as a complete surprise. Gabby had told us a million times that she was heading to LA after graduation. I guess the only shocking part was that she had finally decided not to finish school and quit town right now. Oh, Gabriella. I know, seriously, like, if they're in their senior year, like, she had, what, like, a couple more months left? Like, why'd you have to run away with this person? I have no idea. You've always been so popular in school. <laughs> I'm so sad and shocked that you were a victim of such nasty bullying and someone you considered to be your friend. I hadn't realized it before my mom said it, but she was right. What is, oh, it's my, <laughs> I was like, what's on my neck? Guess it just wanted to show that anyone could be a victim of bullying, even the supposedly popular kids. I've been so caught up in my own problems that I haven't been paying any attention to you recently. I know. Gabriella, let me make it up to you. I'll make pancakes. Da blah, blah blah Are they? I am not going to like, yeah, no thank you. We're gonna go straight to school. I'm gonna skip breakfast. Oh, all right. I suppose we can have a good chat this evening over dinner. <laughs> that is if I make a whole line. No, no. <laughs> Don't be dead. No, Max. Hey, James. I see dead people. That's not funny, Max. <gasps> Very funny, Max. Hey, a little humor never killed anyone. What was this? <laughs> All right, that's a little funny. I'll give you that. Is, is there a report for Faye Green ready yet? Yeah, I've got it here. The cause of death was anaphaxia as a result of anti-mortem constriction of the neck. In English, please, Max. She was murdered. <gasps> Any other signs of trauma? No. Thanks, Max. Anytime. Wait, so it's Gabby alive? <laughs> there were several aspects of the case which was troubling. Aside from the obvious fact that a girl had been murdered, of course. Wait, so did he not murder her? 
Firstly, why was she wearing her cheer uniform when her body was found? There were two possibilities. First, she had changed back into it, which was not logical based on Gabrielle's statement. Second, she put it on right before her murderer had killed her. Why had he done that? Goodness, this is too much. Okay, wait, so did James not kill anyone? He was my prime suspect. The cheer leaders are falling like flies. It's all fun and games until somebody dies. <laughs> what the? What the heck? I'm a princess. That has got to be the creepiest children's rhyme I've ever heard. What the heck? Oh my gosh, Gabriella, did you hear? I can't believe she ran away. She could have at least graduated first before leaving. I mean, we have less than a year to go. It doesn't make sense. Oh no, do you think it might have anything to do with yesterday? Wait, I'm still like, so James isn't the murderer? I thought for sure he was the murderer. I really hope not. Well, I'm sure she didn't make such a big decision just because she doesn't like you, Gabriella. She said a million times she wanted to go to LA. She's just being really irresponsible to do this now. Poor Mr. and Mrs. Mendez. Ask them if they knew about this. Ask them if they know who Gabby's new guy is. I mean, I don't think they knew anything about it, so we'll just ask if they know who the new guy is. Do you guys have any idea at all who this new guy is she's singing? Zero idea. She's been super secretive. It's weird, to be honest. I wonder if her parents are going to report this to the police, or if the police would even do anything. Well, Gabby's only turning 18 in July, so technically she's still a minor. She's so selfish though, isn't she? I mean, couldn't she have run away after this Friday's game? Jeez, Jazz, talk about one track mind. Okay, maybe Jazz is the murderer. Like she's like so upset that nobody's taking like cheerleading seriously. So she's like murdering all the cheerleaders and that's why they're in the cheerleading uniform. No suspicion. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna come right out and say it. What, say what? I know the combination to Gabby's locker. You do? Yes, she gave it to me last week because she wanted me to help her get books that she left inside. OMG, this means we can go through her locker and look for clues. Is this going to be, yeah, I'm not paying to look for lockers, okay? If Gabby wants to run away, then fine. Run away, Gabby. <laughs> the police can go and find her. I'm not paying my gems to find her. I really enjoyed the movie. What about you? I like the twist at the end. It always kept me guessing. What are you feeling for dinner? No, wait! <laughs> At the beginning scene, they found someone in the alleyway. These people are about to find Gabby. No! How about that new Thai restaurant down the street from our place? I've heard that it's halal. Oh, no! Oh, my gosh! No! Hello, officer. There's there's a girl lying in the alley. She's, she's not moving. I think she might be dead. No, don't be dead! What? Excuse me? Oh, what? It says fully released. Um, what? Is this the, the end? Like this can't, what? What? Is she alive? Is she dead? What is happening? Okay, so I looked into it and apparently there is a second season and it's called Envy 2 and the description is two cheerleaders dead in less than one week, which does mean Gabby's dead. <laughs> and a growing romance between a hot homicide detective. Well, you'll be able to find out who the killer is, season two of Envy. So I guess the author released it as like a non like second option or like not like a certified like episode story like a featured one. So I don't know guys. Let me know down below in the comments if we should do season two of Envy. But also let me know by giving this video a big thumbs up because maybe we'll continue on with season two or maybe we will move on to another episode series. So if you want to do another one, let me know down below what we should do. But I, my head is reeling. I don't even know what's happening. So I guess until next time, I will see you guys later so make sure to let me know down below what you want to see me do all right i'll see you guys later bye